guys, it's Queen Deja, and in today's video, I will be reacting right to the final two episodes of Love After World Domination. Let's go ahead and get started with episode 11 in 3, 2, 1, go. Damn, y'all screwed. Oh! So, huh? Oh, she cute. Mm. Yeah. Wait, hold up. That's me. <laughs> I don't know about this. said no <laughs> oh I'm guessing this is code for, hey, we're going to have a sleepover tonight. <laughs> no, a sleepover. Oh! 
いや、ハロウィンタッチだよフフフフフフフフフフフフフフフフフフフフフフフフフフフフフフフフフフフフフフフフフフフフフフフフフフフフフフフフフフフフフフフフフフフフフフフフフフフフフフフフフフフフフフフフフフフフフフフフフフフフフフフフフフフフフフフフフフフフフ I get to lie on Destiny's <laughs> This girl. Mm-hmm. Oh my god, she's so freaking cute. It'd be funny if tomorrow she wears this gold and be like, yeah, where'd you get that scarf?
It's just as charming as the real photo. So <laughs> we gotta make sure. Um, but neither can you, right? <laughs> the music. The music! <laughs> oh. <laughs> No, got plans. <laughs> oh. Oh no. Me when I have to go to work, but I feel like shit. <laughs> Mm -hmm. <laughs> she just <laughs> oh yes <laughs> What the heck? Girl! What up, blood princess? Hold up, wait, wait. Ma'am, ma'am, 
Ma'am, do we have a safe word? Safe word. Red. Safe word is red, ma'am. Red. Let me go. <laughs> oh, God. I feel good. <laughs> I was in hell. <laughs> Right? And y'all all gonna be trapped in front of her. Jesus, that's exactly what she wants. Come on now. Y you said mommy again, babe. Now, you know somebody watching this episode when this came out, somebody, the, the fetish is for somebody was like, up. Oh my god. I'd be scared. How about no? I like her nails though. Pretty color. Huh? No, oh my God. <laughs> special nurse's office. I'm scared. Well, it looks like we ain't going home alive. My Clark Kent hottie.
Aww. Well, it made her go back to sleep, though. Oh! Well, at least you're better now! Damn. Oh my god. <laughs> Nothing. That was cute. Oh my god, but girl. <laughs> I, I, I don't know what to say about the second part of this episode. I mean, the first episode was cute regardless, the first time. Mainly because of the fact is, yes, we get to be a new friend, and Destiny always wants to make friends. I mean, come on now. It's what we do. We girls. Shit. And it's just like, yeah, we're gonna have a sleepover. But the fact is that Judgment, like, instantly walked in as Fudo. Like, bruh. And like, oh shit, are we, like, like, you even had me over here being like, wait, why is Fudo here? What's going on? Oh my god! Like, oh shit, Frey's gonna find out. Oh god! But yeah, when she saw, the, like, um, just took the boots off. That was when you're like, oh, okay. Hmm. Gotcha. But it was so cute. Uh, the <laughs> blood and wanting her sick patients to wear baby outfits. Bruh, are you? What? Yeah, once again, what's the safe word, ma'am? It's red. You know, when somebody says red, we say stop. And you know, hey, get the fuck off me. Back up. <laughs> I'm just saying, like, mm. Mm, 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 mm. <laughs> <laughs> but like, well, like, even though he came. In the end, because he didn't get one single customer, and in the end, she got it signed. Like, that's cute, and I love that he read it to her. And I go, oh my god. But yeah, like I said, somebody, when this episode came out, a whole bunch of y'all probably got that fetish of, damn, I now want to see my significant other wearing a baby costume. Don't lie. You probably did. Mm-hmm. Yeah, you did. <laughs> Cause, oh my god, because somebody had to be like, yes, somebody was like, damn, I want this to happen. Or like, damn, I wish that was me. Oh, y'all was probably thinking that the day this episode came out. Just, <laughs> I have no other fucking comment. But go ahead and pause the video and I will see you guys in one second for the final episode. Alright, final episode and three, two, one, go. <laughs> yeah. 
Yeah. <laughs> and of course the guy I mean the girls can't do it Yeah, but still, it's very similar to a proposal. Yes, from our perspective. Jealousy. Oh my god! Yes! I can't do the commercial. Because I have a girlfriend. Then you do the commercial!
on. <laughs> no, she is <laughs> Oh. I mean, it's cute. Yeah. I was expecting more scare. Not cute. Well, I mean, as a baby, you know, babies are sometimes a little, <sighs> yeah. That didn't even do anything. Oh. Yeah, that ain't do anything to him. Jesus. No, that didn't do anything either. <laughs> oh! Oh, y'all are screwed. And we all just gonna stand there still? Damn. Mm -mm 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 -mm. Perfect. I know, baby. I feel the same way too. Like currently, I'm pissed. My, I'm, I'm pissed at mine. Mm. Like, how would you feel if someone ignored you for a couple of days? Not the greatest, right? Right. And then it's worse when they want to talk to you, and you're like, "Hmm," but I'm still pissed at you.
I really like the way how like he looks really good in all white. I mean, usually normally yes, the female is the only one who has to wear white, and such. So he looks good with it. Can't do it. Wouldn't it be interesting because, okay, you know, this is a, a, a thing born from the ghettos. <laughs> they all help. I mean, hey, I mean mm, anything could happen. We're only at the halfway point of the episode.
his mom. No, I think they're going to help. Oh, no. Mm, 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 mm. No, I was right! Ah! At least she's a bear, though. Uh. Oh, it's just getting bigger. That's so cute. That's the cake that they're gonna cut. Oh my god! <laughs> My damn dog, Jesus Christ. <laughs> Oh no, baby, he could never hate you. We can't have this moment. <laughs> <laughs> sure.
Okay, final thoughts. This show is fucking cute, adorable as hell, and I loved every single week that we went into this. I am sad that this is over, but I'm glad that someone requested this because, yes, I did want to initially watch this show when it was coming out, but, you know, girl was busy as hell with work and all the other stuff that I was reacting to that I was like, I don't think I can take on something else. And I, I have a love-hate relationship on doing that. Like, I love taking on extra stuff when I do have time. But then at the same time, when I do, it feels like then after that, I don't really have time. Like, I really don't have time. But I loved it. I thought Fudo and Destiny, they were, like, freaking adorable. Destiny, once again, is best girl. I've said it once and I'll say it again. Um, it makes me want to see, like, manga-wise, like, what currently is happening in that series and such, because this was a very interesting show. Very different! I mean, I love the fact that we had, you know, Power Rangers and romance. You've never really kind of seen that in an anime together. I mean, yeah, like, if you've watched any of the um, Americanized Power Rangers, especially if you, like, grew up in the 90s like me, and if it came out, so, like, OG, um... What's one that I, uh, like, Ninja Storm? Because Ninja Storm is always the one that always pops up in my head for some weird reason. Um, I think Ninja Storm was also the last Power Rangers show that I watched. Um, but yeah, I always think, I always thought that was cute. I was like, okay, we're kind of getting something and such. Especially because the more, like, deep we got into Power Rangers and the older that you would get, they would start going into certain, like, situations that you know when you got to a certain age you had to deal with but because most of them were all well adults playing teenagers and such they had to you know still make it kind of teen preteen quote friendly but i really enjoyed it i mean this was a very interesting series if uh, freaking light if you will stop stop being a bitch um oh my <laughs> Okay, I'm just going to leave it like that. But definitely would watch this again. Hal definitely would buy the show on Blu-ray. I mean, because that is the plan for, like, most of the shows that I've reacted to. Especially, like, um, Sleeping Princess and the Demon Castle. Like, that is something that I'm initially wanting to buy on Blu-ray. And I, I might end up asking my mom, like, yeah, this is what I want for Christmas. Like, there's something else that I want. Like, it's between that and the last or the current four volumes of Dress Up Darling that I need because volume seven doesn't come out until next year which is okay I can do the whole year that I get to wait it's like that but yeah this was so fucking cute definitely will miss it so I mean now you're probably wondering well um yeah well go ahead now you're probably wondering what the heck am I going to watch next I know patreons are probably wondering and everyone else is more patreons than people um so the next show that we're going to do um, 
is my personal request. Uh, this is something from a season ago that I also wanted to react to at the time. Um, I think a lot of people were, was very shocked that I did not react to this show and was like, well, yeah, you're, this is your forte. Why didn't you watch it? And once again, of course, because I was busy, I just didn't have time for it. And, um, I know I will not give a hint of what it is. I probably will end up watching the first two episodes tomorrow because I do have all, I think 12 or 13 episodes already downloaded and everything. Um, but the only hint that you already got is it's something from last season, um, I'll give you one other hint. Um, if you guys know, I am on this podcast with a whole bunch of other, um, of my YouTuber friends. It's the Weaves of the Round Table. Um, they did, or really a little bit of myself, kind of talked about this show in one of the videos that we did for talking about the previous season of the anime. So that is another hint. But yeah, I mean, other than that, guys, you know, you'll have to wait and see. But other than that, that is my reaction view towards the entirety of Love After World Domination. If you guys enjoyed it, please give me a like. It really helps me out. Also, subscribe to my channel. I make videos every single day. Join the Master Squad. And of course, I will see you guys officially all next Saturday for Patreons and next Wednesday for everybody else for the first two episodes of Insert This Show Here that you will all find out next week. But until then, I will see you guys all next time. Bye!